Okay, so I know I just did a haul, literally, um, what's day, Tuesday, so Sunday, but Bendles was calling my name today, everyone. It really was. I mean, I got out of work early. It was fairly nice out. It's like 93, though, out in the city, which means not like nice 93, let's go to the beach weather. It means 93, it's so freaking humid outside, you, oh, it's so annoying, and on the subway, there's, like, no air coming, like, underground, obviously, it's so hot, so I probably look a lot redder than I actually am, because I literally just got home from Bendel's, and I bought too much, way too much, but that's okay because I've really wanted it for a long time and it's been in like the back of my mind like go to Bendel's, Sharice, go to Bendel's. So I finally just did and I got out of the way and I'm really excited to show you everything that I got. So basically, okay, I went to Bendel's, I walked in and I was just kind of like wandering around. There's a lot of people there which is kind of weird I guess for um, like after work time. It's usually rush hour. People are going home to Jersey and Long Island and just in Manhattan in general so I was kind of surprised by the amount of people in there but anyway so I went to Laura Mercier and I really need a new foundation because the one I I used to use Estee Lauder and I liked it it was great coverage but it was really orange and it, it just I had to blend it out so much so I decided I really needed a new foundation and Victoria's Secret I was using for a while I forget what it's called um, I think it's like something like flawless foundation, something like that. Anyway, I was using that. wasn't good enough coverage for me personally, but it was good. Um, then I kind of bounced into CoverGirl, um, their Nature Luxe Silk Foundation, which was really great. Not the right color. I picked out the wrong color, so that was my fault. But it is a great foundation. Surprisingly, I was really like pleasantly surprised with the quality of it. Um. So yeah, I really needed a new foundation because I was like mixing all these products just so I could get something on my face every day. So I went in there and obviously Laura Mercier has great reputation, great foundation, blah blah blah. You guys probably know about that. Um, so I really wanted, I wanted to see one, what it would look like on me because I, any like luxury item purchases that I make I always always research and like that's such a huge thing for me I'm always online always googling YouTubing finding out more about the product what's in the product things like that because I want to make sure if I'm gonna spend a good amount of money on something it's gonna be worth it and so I went up to the woman at Laura Mercier um, at the Bendel's on 5th Avenue and I was like okay I'm gonna be totally honest with you I need a new foundation I need new concealer and I'm solely coming to Laura Mercier based on her reputation. I've never tried it, and I really, like, wow me, basically. And so she was so nice, so sweet. Um, and so she sat me down, took all my makeup off. Literally, I had none. So she used the Perfecting Water, which hydrated my face. Um, something about a face polish? I don't really know. Anyway, she used, like, a moisturizer, a primer this perfecting water stuff all really really great products um and then she got to the foundation which was great and then to the concealer which was great again and then the under eye concealer um and then a uh, universal powder to set the actual foundation and concealer and stuff and also a highlighter slash bronzer duo um and then great lip color and a awesome lip gloss. I've never seen my lips transform that much. It's really cool. So Laura Mercier, awesome. I will go into her products. So I got, I ended up getting the um, foundation, lip gloss, and under eye concealer. And then she gave me a sample of a little something. Um, so the Foundation is moisturizing foundation, and I got it in the color Warm Ivory. That's the outside packaging, and then um, obviously what it looks like. Sorry, my nails. I'm moving floors at work, so I've been picking up boxes and packing away binders and moving products, and so all my nails are totally chipped off, so don't look at them. So this is it, which it is a great little bottle. 
all of this stuff because I mean it is expensive obviously um, but I think it's a good amount and obviously it's a great foundation so expensive but worth it to me some people don't feel that way which is totally cool I was there in your place a couple years ago I was like that's insane but no I'm not um, then I got the Laura Mercier secret concealer for under the eye um, in number two color and it's this little guy really cute sleek packaging I love that about her it's very sleek to the point it's like almost sexy or something um, so there it is number two then the last thing and I'm not big on spending really that much on lip products I'm not like crazy in love with lip products as I am like eyes per se I feel like a lot of people are like that but this thing was awesome it is Laura Mercier lip glossé I think is how you say it um, in lilac great color I love it I felt like um, what's her name Rosie the Victoria's Secret Angel that's in the new Transformers I was like oh my lips they're like rosy lips and I'm obsessed with her by the way so let's see I don't know I'm in love with it I don't know why I'm usually not this crazy about lip products but that thing's awesome um, I want to say this was 22 hold on let me get the receipt so you guys know some gurus don't tell prices of things um, you can check it out on the internet either way so I think it's easier if I just tell you right because I'm always wondering the prices of things but I don't know maybe it's just me um, so the concealer was 22 the um, foundation was 42 and the lip gloss a was 22 so um, obviously expensive products I completely agree if you feel like that's insane um, if you have it and that's what you want to spend your money on that's the way I view it that's how I am so that's what I did oh and she gave me this great sample um, I forget what the product is called but it's a um, it's an exfoliator it smells really good it's an exfoliator but it's also a moisturizer so it does both it hydrates while getting rid of the dead skin which is awesome um, I got some on me and they're perfectly round beads one of the um, makeup artists there said so that's really cool which is a great product um, but yeah I just didn't get it moving on so then I went to the NARS section and um, she showed me the brand new collection that just came out and they had such a great eyeshadow um, trio I forget the exact name but it was gorgeous beyond belief but it was 45 and I didn't need another eyeshadow and I was planning on going to Mac anyway so I went ahead and I got this blush instead um, highlighting highlighting blush powder from the new collection and it is the name is um, new order prettiest color it's such like a cute adorable color it's not like um not like a ooh that's sexy or sultry or like anything like that it's just so cute it's totally girls next door that is it new order from their new collection it's so pretty I can't even explain it it's like this um, lilac -y purple pink blush color with silver and gold reflex in it and she put it even a little bit on my eyes it's really cute so it can definitely duo for a blush and an eyeshadow so I really liked that this was 27 I think that was 27 so not horrible then I went over to Mac so I, I just got two eyeshadows um, one in nylon and the other in lucky green and I just got the pan form because that's cheaper pretty much um, I'm just gonna get a um, palette from one of those websites that um, you know they're just magnetic so okay you know I'm just gonna take it off this is oh this is lucky green such a pretty green I'm in love with it I'm gonna do that mermaid um 
sultry green eye tutorial that I told you guys about in my last haul video two days ago um, using this and the NYX palette that I originally used but I'm excited to use that one too. Then I got nylon which is a great highlight color and inner corner color. Um, it's such a pretty sheen. So both of those and in pan form they are only 11 Yes, 11. So that's not bad at all. Um, so yeah, that's everything that I got. Um, Laura Mercier, NARS, and MAC. Great, great brands. It is expensive, but it's worth it. And I get to make more midi videos of tutorials and everything like that. So I'm going to do an updated foundation routine and that sultry green eye look as well as I'm gonna think of something cute maybe do an outfit pairing with the new gloss and the blush from NARS because they kind of work well together so maybe I'll do like a cute little like girl next door outfit of the day with those I don't know incorporate it somehow so yeah let me know what you guys think and I will talk with everybody later bye guys